Hey everybody, welcome back to Peak State Mathematics. We're gonna turn up the speakers, get the energy flowing so we can learn in Peak State. Let's go. We're looking at reflections. We're going to take objects and reflect them kind of like a mirror over an axis, X or Y axis. We've got some rules where you'll change from your X, Y into either negative X, Y or X, negative Y and uh, flip it on over. So let's slow it down, break it down and give you a more in-depth look. So to get there, if we're looking at the y-axis, obviously we're flipping across the y-axis. I'm a big fan of graphing this first so that you get some visual help with it. So I'm going to go ahead and plot my pre-image points over here. P is at 1, 2, Q at 2, 5, R at 8, 3, and S at 7, 0. So this will give me my rectangle to start with. Now every single one of these points I'm going to reflect across this y-axis. And essentially what that's like, like think about looking into a mirror, I'm going to be equal distance, but kind of opposite to the other side. So if I'm like one unit to the right of the Y axis, then I'm going to reflect it so that I'm one unit to the left. And we're essentially just that equidistant, right? So if I'm looking at S prime, which was at seven zero, I'm seven units to the right. So I'm flipping over now seven units to the left P prime. I'm one unit. Uh, but still up at that same height of two. So my Y values really aren't changing at all. Just my X's are basically being negated. Uh, and we're going to take a look at that and call that basically our rule for this because you know, that's what we're noticing. We're noticing that the X values get negated and that our Y values are going to stay the exact same. So let's write that down kind of as a general rule for this example. That means that your X, Y coordinate points going to go to a negative X, Y coordinate point. So P prime will switch to negative one, two Q prime is going to go to a negative two, five R primes at negative eight, three and S primes at negative seven, zero. There is your final image. everybody thanks so much for watching this video lesson I hope you enjoyed it and you learned something please hit subscribe so you have access to all of our video lessons and if you want live free tutoring with me every single Monday check out peakstatemathematics.com and sign up for that until next time remember always learn in a peak state